Since 1991, the Georgia Intern Fellowships for Teachers, or GIFT program, has placed middle and high school teachers in over 1,200 science, mathematics, and technology internships throughout Georgia. Rich with cutting-edge technology and the latest practical applications of science, math, and technology, every GIFT internship offers a glimpse into the employment opportunities of the future, which teachers bring back to their classrooms to share with the workforce of tomorrow, their students. GIFT a program of the Center for Education Integrating Science, Mathematics, and Computing, a unit of the College of Sciences at Georgia Tech, is made possible through a collaborative partnership of businesses, universities, and local school districts. It is one of the largest and longest running scientific work experience programs for teachers in the country. In 2008, GIFT placed 72 teachers in internships throughout the state. The following four segments, which were filmed during the summer of 2008, offer a snapshot of the many varied experiences enjoyed by GIFT Fellows this summer. Uh, my name is Nicole Satchel and I teach Earth Science, sixth grade level at East Cobb Middle School. This summer at Georgia Power, I'm working in the compliance and chemistry area. Uh, Kay Farner is the team leader for that area. The chemistry area, of course, will take care of the testing of the raw materials and uh, just making sure that the materials that are going through the process are meeting certain specifications and what have you. Uh, the compliance area basically makes sure that the plant meets all types of environmental standards and regulations. Nicole is being trained to assist me into uh, properly fitting our employees to go in into potentially health hazard areas <clears throat> uh, properly protected with the adequate equipment uh, under state and federal regulatory uh, requirements. Okay, he passed that test because he had a fit factor of 282. What I've learned from Nicole is uh, the certain skill sets that are required uh, to bring into the workforce uh, that she could possibly use in a classroom, that we can marry the two together and that we can have a stronger work pool. Georgia Power and Southern Company right now is, is under tremendous pressure to get qualified and skilled uh, a labor force. A little spreadsheet here is, uh, so that I can say who's been fit tested in every department. This is an actual <laughs> very, very beneficial program to us right now. It really is. I'm very happy and honored to have been chosen for the gift program and um, I hope that it continues because it definitely has gift has uh, lots of benefits. Uh, I'm Stuart Zola. I'm the director of the Yerkes National Primate Research Center. It uh, really has been a great fortune of ours to uh, be able to actually uh, host the gift program here and begin to develop it. This is our first year uh, in the program uh, and we've had uh, wonderful uh, teacher Christy with us and uh, three really terrific students uh, who have worked with us uh, and uh, you know this is really in the most concrete terms a terrific idea first of all because we believe and hope that we are actually able to catalyze uh, in some students minds what the idea of being a scientist is and uh, the notion is that we are going to be helping generate the next generation of scientists who uh, will solve some of the great uh, health problems of our world, so it provides us that opportunity. We've been scoring monkeys here at Yerkes, and it has been really interesting to watch their behavior. The gift program has just been overall very exciting and very enriching for me. Um, I've never actually been to the zoo very much, so I never got to be in close contact with any kind of animal. So doing this, I mean to observe monkeys and how they're so similar to humans is just overly amazing. It was a rewarding experience because I've done so much here that I never did before ever. I found that what we're doing in the classroom needs to really come up a level and students really need that 
upper level um, scientific knowledge. They need to know how research is done on the college level. They need to know how research is done on the professional level. It's great just to see how students are these days and to know that um, when you meet these students and talk with them uh, that we're actually in pretty good shape. The next generation is, is uh, pretty cool and, and I think we're going to have a, a good world ahead of us uh, if we're in the hands of uh, people like Christy, the teacher, and these students in particular. My name is Stephen King. I am a Connections Learning Lab teacher for grades K through 5 at Whit Davis Elementary School in Clark County, Athens, Georgia. And this summer I had the pleasure of working with Mary Ann Robinette, who is the coordinator for the entomology department at the University of Georgia. My program entailed studies on insects and birds of Costa Rica, and a trip to Costa Rica was the focal point of this entire course. We flew to Costa Rica and spent 17 days there. We traveled extensively throughout the country, and the whole focus of each destination was to examine and study the birds and the insects in that particular area. The best thing that I can say about the GIFT program is it's opened my eyes to a lot of uh, fascinating studies that I was able to gather through this program that would have not been possible otherwise. And through this, and through all the, the, the extensive research that I was able to do in Costa Rica, I will be able to apply what I've learned to all 675 students in my school that I teach. More importantly, not only did I learn about insects and birds, but I learned about energy, classification, animals and plants, ecosystems and diversity. So this, this opportunity will actually be able to assist me in many different areas of uh, instruction. All in all, my trip was so fantastic and I was able to learn so much and be able to, to bring back so much knowledge that will continue to be used in my classroom and benefit the students. Thank you. My name is Seda Askar from Westlake High School, a rising senior. <laughs> My name is Jessica Bailey. I'm at Westlake High School and I'm a rising senior as well. These are two different cranes. Right now, this crane is upside down so that we can attach the boom and um, all this you see going on is um, basically like reinforcement. The objective of our project is to determine seismic risk on key cranes at major seaports um, around the world and my group is actually um, going to build a model crane and actually test it, um, retrofit the members at retrofit areas of the crane at certain members or to test the acceleration stress and strain on those members. We're actually going to put them on the shake table and test different types of um, well, first we're going to actually see the acceleration in the different joints and then focus on different remediation strategies to try to help this crane react, yeah, react better during earthquakes. For me, the most rewarding part of my job is actually working with the GIF students and the teachers. And for the past few years, the teachers that have come do not have backgrounds in engineering or even close fields so they've been biology or chemistry and so they seem to be kind of just as lost as the students are and so I'm helping guide them in terms of how to take what they're learning here back to their classrooms and make it a meaningful experience for them as well. I think the GIFT program has allowed me to uh, share that learning experience with the students. Um, as they learn, I learn different things about the different concepts that were taught to us throughout the different um, conferences that we had this summer. I actually am interested in the field of engineering to be a patent lawyer, so that's my goal. Wow. At our school, we have a very strong program with Georgia Tech itself, so I think this gives me more so of that experience again about the best things about tech and what it has to offer, so. Gift experiences provide teachers with first-hand knowledge on how scientists and engineers actually approach problems, design experiments, and analyze data. Thanks to the support of its extended family of corporations, universities, and school districts, 
GIFT also offers Georgia students an unparalleled opportunity to recognize and seize the opportunities that will exist in the workplace of tomorrow.